Hello and welcome to Game Over 2. Very, very good games. Almost the tournament has come alive as a result of the two games. Let's start from the first. West Indies versus Bangladesh, it was always expected to be a close one. Uh, West Indies batting first was a bit unfortunate, I'd say. The, the Kiran Pollard having to go off Andre Russell, that uh, dismissal when it hit Taskin's hand and ricochet onto the non-striker stumps. So West Indies is 145, I mean, was... I thought a bit a bit less, 10-15 runs less, but the finish was strong. The finish was really, really strong from the West Indies thanks to some outstanding batting from Nicholas Puran. So that allowed the momentum to go the West Indies when then when Bangladesh batted, they again had the game in control till Andre Russell bowled a fantastic final over redeeming himself and winning West Indies their first match of this particular tournament. Pakistan, Afghanistan, what an atmosphere. It was, you know, electric. Even better than India versus Pakistan, I'd say. Chock-a-block stadium, incredible intensity and a cracking game. Pakistan bowled beautifully till 70 for 6 and then that partnership between Gulbadeen Naib, uh, you know, and uh, Mohammad Nabi. And then when it was Afghanistan's turn, Rashid Khan was yet again magic before finally Asif Ali swung the scales with those four huge sixes of Karim Jaddat closing the match out for Pakistan. Pakistan now topping the pool and almost certain to top the pool, uh, making India New Zealand that very important encounter, virtual knockout. I will be back with more on Game Over with England versus Australia tomorrow. Keep watching this space.